everyone, my name is Marge and I'm the CEO and founder of Telework PH, an outsourcing and virtual assistant staffing company. We help companies and business owners increase revenue and EBITDA through ethical and fair labor outsourcing to the Philippines. Today you are watching Thursdays with the CEO. Hiring, whether it be an offshore or an in-house staff, can be both a pain and a gain. Instinctively, when we see a gap within our process or in a business, we solve it by hiring a person who can perform the role and will fill that gap. This is not always a smart move and I will tell you why later. But the next question that we then ask is, do we have the funds to pay for a skilled staff? But then there is another question that's always left out of the equation, and that is, what role are you actually filling? And is this a role that will directly impact revenue? We all know that the relationship between revenue growth and labor cost is not parallel. Salaries and wages will continue to be a step up in cost, while revenue is more like a slope. It may go up or down at any time. If these two variables do not meet, you have a huge problem. That said, when should you really hire based on anticipated growth? Here's my rule of thumb. Do not solve a problem you do not have. If you are just anticipating it, don't proceed yet. I know as business owners, we would like to be ready for what could happen. Just like when you have an increased um, ad spend, hoping for an influx in inquiries, you then hire a person to oversee the influx in these inquiries. The problem with this is that the cost had started before we even have the means to pay for the cost. So when the strategy doesn't work, you're left paying more in costs. The best way to approach this is to mitigate the risks and the costs. Leverage on technology to fill a gap in your business. Revisit your current process to get rid of the non-value adding tasks that are causing extra and unnecessary layers. Also, by hiring an offshore staff for a fraction of the cost, you're not only getting the execution done, but also minimizing the impact on your financials.